It might not be Jemison, but this ship is starting to feel like home. Two steps in, and we're already looking at a corpse. Okay, it's not Vanguard Moara. It looks like spaces are scavenging around here, and someone else came in and said hello. Oh, this won't be your last encounter with a spacer crew. They pillage abandoned facilities and shoot anyone who gets in their way. They're even less organized than the Crimson Fleet. Just countless desperate groups scavenging and killing to survive. Set aside anything useful and just leave the rest.
like another boss. Initiating switch. Give it your best shot. You have anything valuable? Damn it!
Am I glad to meet whoever you two are? Looks like we're all in one piece. Any day you walk away from, right? What? You guys still exist? Man, I've only heard stories. We've heard stories too, about a strange object you found on patrol. So, you know what that is? Mm, it doesn't play nice with... So you're saying I shouldn't be using it? Hey, I'll trade some weird... Hope you figure out whatever that thing is. Let's grab the artifact. Good work. Let's get back to the lodge. Service, Captain. It fits. Energy spiked a bit, but it's restabilized. Is there anything new showing up? No, it's the same as before. There's a massive output as the artifact is added, then it harmonizes. Like it's waiting for the others. Hmm, that's speculation, but I think you're right. We need more. Here. You've earned this. Welcome to Constellation. As a full member this time. We're going to do great things. By the way, how would you like to keep traveling? I'm not sitting behind. And I want you out there as well. <laughs> so that's what it feels like. Fine. But I'm not... First, there's an expedition that Samco has been putting. There's also the Eye. Oh. And last but not least, Noel. Have we... A courier from Argos Extractors came by to let us know they're packing up the operation on Vectera. But that's it. No other word. Mm, that's not good. We should get over. Bye for now. Well, that... Oh, no. Don't start. I've had enough Barrett for one lifetime. I don't need the sequel showing up on my doorstep. More pirates showed up when you were gone. We weren't as lucky this time. Calvert. Troy. Some of the new Dusties. They didn't make it. Well, how could you have? You weren't... Anyway, I was pinned down behind some crates with Barrett. Bullets and laser fire everywhere. No, I started stealing myself to go out fighting. Then that idiot puts his hand on my shoulder. Next thing I know, two of the pirates are dead, and he's got the third. Drags him out into the open at gunpoint and demands to talk, or else I'm going to demonstrate Newton's. And that's when they brought out Helen. I didn't overhear everything, but after the ten longest seconds of my life, Barrett, and that's the last I saw of either of them. They could have grav jumped anywhere. I tried pinging a transmission to the ship in the comms building before they left, but the pirates must have fried it. You want to try it? Go ahead. But the.
grab jump calculations before we're out of range. Out of range of what? Out of range of the sensor. Keep up. Once we're outside the star system, the bandwidth goes from instant speed to effectively never. What good is sending a transmission? So, you actually get that computer working again? What? Let me see that. <laughs> Funny. Okay. Let me send you the location data. Well, don't start buying me stuffed animals for my birthday or anything. But yes, all right. I don't... Just get after them, okay? And hey, if you ever need a little extra help, I've been thinking about a career... Seems like you've been keeping busy. My contract's up with Argo. Works for me. Right. I'll get to work. Let's catch up later. you. In here I thought you were some pirate coming back to kill me. Lucky me, right? Nah. Nah. I'll, I'll be alright. Just, you know, wasn't trying to move around too much with all the painkillers and nausea meds running through me. Man, I was so terrified when I got pulled on board that pirate ship. There it was all. Sorry, brother. I'll get it. Oh, um, he tells me we need to start pretending to fight each other. <laughs> Trick the pirates into thinking they need to come in. Before one of us gets... I just remember him shouting, This kid is a killer. How am I supposed to defend myself against these early whites? I mean, I didn't think it would work, but they came in. All of a sudden, we were wrestling with two of them. Barrett reached for one of them. Bingo. Blasted the pilot right in the back. <laughs> Through to the flight console. <sighs> I blacked out. And when I came... You missed the fun part, Heller. <laughs> Man, he did the little... Oh, yeah. Probably should have talked about that first. So, I was real excited when a ship showed up. <laughs> then, less excited. And then, really, really less excited when Barrett said... I was drifting in and out, but... Yeah, I think so. Got a signal from the ship before they grab jumped. Guessing it was Barrett. <laughs> Haven't really been in a good <clears throat> space to have a listen. <laughs> Here you go. Hey, uh, uh, I should come with you, right? I don't think anyone else is coming. Yeah, just uh, don't ask me to hop. <sighs> Give me a minute. I think the worst of it is. Yeah, I'll be all right. I'll be all right. Ready to watch? Let me know when you want to head out. Still think there might be a spot for me on your ship? Phew, oh, I'm glad to hear you say that. For a second there, I... You got it. Catch you on the flip side, boss. Thanks for letting me tag along. Hey, 
There's no certainty to the universe at all. Once you really start getting out there, the laws of physics kind of turn into suggestions. You're pulling my leg again, right? No exaggerations this time. Hmm. Let me think. Unicorn. Not kidding. Wait. The mystical mare with the magic horn thing? Come on. Was King Arthur riding on it too? Oh, holy shit. You actually found me. Well, this is turning into a regular constellation party, isn't it? I should have brought drinks. You know, it's actually been kind of nice. Matsura the Grim here is a great host. No sense letting people's last moments be unpleasant. See, that's what I like about you, Matsura. Real renaissance man. I have enjoyed our time together, Barrett. But I can't just let you go with nothing to show for it. Is Constellation willing to pay ransom in exchange for this man's freedom? You want me to end all this... All the more reason... Don't assume because... He has been... Yeah. I've got no simp... Enough. That settles that. Likewise, Matsur. Good luck with all... I see what you did there, Walter. And I know you've been secretly crying into your piles of money just waiting for my return. Actually, Walter has been complaining about you more than usual, which is always a sign when he's worried. Don't start, Kanji. Wait, is that? <laughs> and to think the first artifact was taking up dust on the library shelf. Now look at them all. You feel it a bit can't you? Ever since I found the second one, I had the visions. Being around them is just comforting. So hey, I I'm still not a hundred percent, plus I feel guilty dragging you into all of this. Why don't I stick around and help you get adjusted to the weird corners of the universe? You don't want to get dragged down in the gravity of my genius. I get it. Let me know if you change your mind.
We got a rook on deck. Good to see Constellation getting some fresh blood. Wish I could have been down at the lodge to see the artifacts come together. But I got a little lost peeking through the eye. Always preferred working alone, even around people I like. But we're... Now, this station, the Eye, rigged up for deep space scans. Barrett and Sarah teased out the signs of where our artifacts could be hiding after we caught our second one. But the data takes a slow ride along the Sea of Light. Years or decades between us and the fringes of... You won't be the only constellation out there. Andresia and Matteo are both following up on scans themselves. Matteo went out recently, but Andresia... It's been a while. Hate to pull the worried old man act on you, but... I'm an old man, and... I'm worried. She should be at one of the two sites I've marked on your star map. Can take care of herself, but... We all need backup sometimes. Anyway... Hopefully you'll be catching Fortune's smile, and we'll have some more artifacts to take a closer look at. Happy hunting. That's why I missed your little welcome party. Got caught up plotting all the data the eye can give us. Wouldn't mind the helper's hand, though. Could speed the process along. Up-to-date planetary scans would help filter all the data I have to sift through. Maybe help to find the anomalous bits. And Constellation can slide a credit or two your way. All part of the mission of charting the stars, right? Then we're hand in hand in agreement. Now get out there and burn some helium. Let's deal. Show the words another time, then.
nav drives cracked and leaking helium-3. The ship can't jump right now. Um, what's helium-3? Helium-3 is a stable isotope of helium that is used as fuel for grav drives, Tashi. What's a grav drive? You know what a grav drive is. Or you should. You wrote a paper on it. <laughs> I'm not sure Billy does know what a grav drive is. Class, please, talk quietly amongst yourselves. This is important. Do you have any extra ship parts? Let me see. Mrs. Whitmore, who are you talking to? Is it a pirate? Pirates? There are pirates? What? No. No pirates. Everyone is safe. Uh-huh. At least she could have been like a marine. A volunteer pilot? How daring. See? The authorities are here and they'll help us. Thank you. Now, everyone, settle down. The driver said ship parts should be sufficient for us to repair our ship. Thank you so much. Stay safe out there. Class, we'll be leaving shortly. Everyone, buckle in. Don't come any cl You are from Constellation. You are the newest member, yes? Do they often send you to check up on other Morsi? Perhaps. I suspect Vladimir worried you might find me on the ground. We waste time. We should complete our mission and then we can talk. Meet your death! And once again, we are triumphant. Always worth checking. Never know what you might find in their pockets.
Are you prepared to die? You did not respond when I called to you after you pulled out the artifact. Does that mean Barrett's theory and experience were correct? The artifact grants the first person who touches it a vision? The fact that it has happened to both you and Barrett is already more than we had before. I think it is important that we discuss what you saw back there. That man. What I had done. It was, yes. I appreciate that you see it that way. A very practical outlook, not one I find is shared amongst members of Constellation. May I ask what your background is? Argos. I have heard of this company. Small, reckless. Interesting. I do not have experience with this profession, but I have my own experiences with... <sighs> ...risk. We both seem to be... ...unusual additions to Constellation. Please, I would ask that you not mention to Vladimir the... ...the circumstances in which you found me. This is not the first time that... ...Varun Zealots have attempted to corner me. If it is known that this has happened again, well, it has been a while since I was given an assignment on my own. I would not want it to be even longer in the future. Do you understand? Mom, this means we are in agreement. Thank you. That is good to know. I will finish here and return to New Atlantis when I can. You should go now. ...as they will be expecting us. Satisfied with the quarters available to you. Look at you two. I'm jealous. I tried following up on some leads myself, but came back empty handed. They could be anywhere, can't they? Embedded in a rock or in the hands of an unsuspecting novelty goods trader? 
I catch myself just staring at the collection sometimes, wondering what it all means. Maybe that's how our ancestors felt when they were looking up at the stars for the first time. They didn't just gawk at the stars, Mateo. They explored, they tested. Science brought us to space, not daydreaming. I disagree. What's the point of science if not to enable humanity's dreams? And where do those dreams come from? Not every dream is a pleasant one. I agree with Noel. The work is what moves us forward. You're with me, right? Science or dreams? Which one is the true muse of space exploration? Neutrality in a debate? I guess your side forfeits. Uh, how can you forfeit if you don't even take a side? You're getting rusty with your comebacks, Mateo. You know what? I just realized I completely overtook this whole conversation. This should be about you and Andresia celebrating a win for the group. I do not mind being asked to join in a debate. It was good to hear everyone's sides. But I do agree that we accomplished something together. Thank you for your help. this another time yes so am i let me know if you need me noel pulling some interesting data from those new artifacts Now that those artifacts aren't just blips of hope in the Blackest Sea, I found an interesting pattern. The grav anomaly generated by one of those artifacts? It matches one on another planet. A bigger one. All right, let me transfer over the data. But I need you wearing caution's boots for this one. No telling what this thing is or what. Going to send you the mark close as I can. But I'm having trouble pinpointing the soul. Don't know what you'll find. And from there, maybe you catch... Rix's bones. Look at you. If you don't mind, I'm gonna start doing some scans. Like, right now. We were right about the anomaly, weren't we? Tip our ears on the tail. An entire building generating a signature just like the artifact. Um, Vladimir, look at these readings. Cardiovascular and neurological levels aren't in the normal range. I think we're going to need a little demonstration. Mind putting the paces to it? Everyone saw that, right? Like a literal gift from the heavens. And also the most practical consequence of our little venture thus far. Got no old shipwise for this one. Going to just call weird weird 
so we have artifacts, a temple, and this power. All connected. Can we find more of them? Already picked one up from the scans. Matches another one of the artifacts we found. In theory, there might be one temple for each. But sifting through all the signs to identify a match is tricky. Impossible if we don't have the right artifact to compare. And even then, it takes time. Don't think it's just Fortune's laugh that this temple responded to you. The artifacts, the visions, this power you've gotten, all seems to be the same song somehow. Plenty to think about. Anyway, catch a smile out there. I'll work on finding planet anomalies that match the other artifacts we have.